you can see doesn't have his feet you know, resting over the brake or accelerator. Yeah, right now it's detecting the red light, it knows that it's appropriate not to go. You really want the system to be as chill as possible because you want to get, make sure that a human has time if they don't like what the car is doing. I mean, look, look at the wheel. <laughs> Yeah. Like, very unusual for Vegas. I feel like I've spent half of my time here sitting in red lights. But this is handling a very nice. Right. You put on the blinker and it made the automatic lane change. Do you have to nudge it at all? You nudge the wheel, yeah. yeah. Are you also having to check your mirrors and stuff? Or is it checking it for traffic? It checks for you. If I try to do a lane change now, so it's car detected okay. in one spot. Now I can do the lane change. Okay. If you weren't to turn the blinker off, would it continue to do more lane changes? Yeah. Uh, only if you nudge it again. Uh, Without an end-to-end -end system, you can't tell the difference between stopping for a car stopped at a red light and stopping for a car stopped and go traffic. Humans do these two things very differently. Humans will come up much faster to a car and stop and go traffic because they think that it might go. Whereas if you see a stopped car and a red light, you'll actually slow down much earlier. Mm -hmm. And you can see that's what this is doing here.